Avast, a scoundrel on my ship. You're in a world of trouble now. You see, here on the sea we live by a code. And you broke that code the second you tried to steal our booty. A pirate's claim is their claim. And you thought you could swoop in and take the chest. I found the map, and my crew did the hard work. So you've got a few choices now. You can walk the plank and be chum for the sharks. You can sit in the brig and hope you make it back to shore, but we'll be dropping you off somewhere isolated. And there's one more choice. One more thing you could do to atone for your total disrespect for the code that Jolly Roger stands for. You can be my slave. You may not realize this, but there's a good reason they call me the Pirate Queen. Every single member of my crew sees me that way. They spread the word and the legend spreads, but you see, they're all under my control. Completely. Not because I'm the captain of the ship, no, but because they see me as their queen. And they're totally and utterly devoted to me. You can keep that right grin off your face, but you saw the way they obey my every word. The way this ship runs like clockwork. This ship shape, and then there's this ship. The finest, the cleanest, best run vessel on the seas. That's thanks to my control. And you know every member of this crew was captured just like you. The first few were on land, back home, and one just happened to be the captain of this very ship. He was having a few drinks in the local pub, and while he spent some time with me, and decided I should have his ship. I picked up some crew members along the way, and every time we capture some new prisoner like you, they end up enthusiastically joining us, devoted to this ship and their queen. That grin seems to be slipping. You're wondering if this is all real. You're sitting here in the captain's cabin as the ship rocks back and forth on the ocean waves. Having seen my crew totally obedient and devoted, and your doubts are starting to fade, starting to drift away on the waves. There's something relaxing about the sea, isn't there? About the ocean? Maybe that's why we come here. Why some are drawn to it? Drawn to new adventures. Peaceful islands, the soft, gentle sway, the creak of wood. It's a peace you can never know on land. A peace you can always have with me. That's all my crew wanted, to find purpose and meaning and peace and calm, and maybe some pleasure too. Thank you for listening. If you want to hear more of me, you can find lots of exclusive content on Patreon. Check the description for details. See you next time.